Hi, I'm Mark Acosta, Assistant Metro Editor here at the Press Enterprise. I'm here with Jeff Horstman, who covers the Temecula area for us. We're going to talk today, uh, Jeff, about the uh, proposed Liberty Quarry for uh, the Temecula area. Uh, tell me, uh, we've written a lot about this. Let's talk a little bit first about granite construction. Um, people might not realize they're not just about quarries, so maybe you could talk about that a little bit for us. That's right, Mark. Granite Construction is actually a very large company, uh, active in 18 states. They were founded in 1922, and in terms of making the aggregate, which is what you get out of the quarry, these you know loose rocks you know that are used in For cement, building, and, right? yeah, the building uh, applications and so forth. Uh, that's actually a rather you know small part of their business. Uh, they do the bulk of their work in general contracting, roads, bridges, a lot of you know government contracts, things like that, and uh, you know they make a lot of money. They uh, you know have revenues of over a billion dollars, and uh, you know they're you know, generally regarded as, you know, one of the major companies in, in California, one of the major companies in this field. So in the in the field, in the industry, what is the reputation? Uh, what is the reputation among others in the industry? Well, I talk to people in trade groups and generally they are acknowledged as a major player and that, uh, you know, they have a very good reputation. Um, they like to talk about how they play, place a high emphasis on character. They have everyone sign this code of conduct that they're going to act, you know, honorably and ethically and uh, um, and so forth, and they've actually won awards, a number of awards, including uh, from a um, institute called Ethisphere for their ethical practices. Um, they've won various environmental um, and um, other types of awards for uh, the quality of their uh, projects. So, um, they, and they're also known for printing, uh, you know bumper stickers with the slogan character matters so they value their reputation uh, very highly right now I understand that there's various agencies that also give out uh, fines and penalties and I understand granite has received some of those as well that's true and in some cases uh, you know very major penalties or are, are out-of-court settlements uh, for instance they just settled a f uh, for four hundred thousand dollars a lawsuit with the city of San Diego which alleged that they were overcharging for wildfire debris cleanup uh, they've also been fined uh, by the state of Oregon for water quality they've been fined by various air management districts uh, tens of thousands of dollars for uh, uh, dust emissions and things like that um, they even had to settle a fine um, a few years ago from the U from a federal agency when a uh, worker working at one of their uh, quarries was killed and they originally fined sixty thousand dollars and they settled for about uh, twenty one thousand dollars in that case interesting Okay, so on this proposed quarry, what comes next? What's the next step on this thing? Well, the uh, Riverside County Planning Commission is going to have its fifth hearing on this project, uh, August 15th down in Temecula, and uh, at the last hearing, Granite was doing more kind of uh, rebuttal to all the criticisms of, of, the, of the project, and that's expected to continue. It's possible the commission may come to a vote um, in that meeting, or they might need one more, and after they vote, which are essentially a, a series of findings or decisions um, on various permits and so forth. It's the project's going to go to the uh, county board of supervisors, and they're going to ultimately decide whether the quarry is uh, going to be. And broken. they might take more than one session as well. I'm assuming. Um, if the uh, plan planning commission is any indication, yeah, I mean they're going to take more. I mean the planning commission, uh, you know, the one of the hearings lasted 15 hours and ended at midnight. So um, yeah, I don't think wow. we're going to be going to see a quick decision on this right. one way or the other. Well, that's it from here, right? now so make sure to uh, read Jeff's story in the press enterprise about granite construction who they are uh, what they've accomplished uh, and also some of the criticisms of them and make sure to check out pe.com we have a special Liberty Quarry section that coordinates all the different past articles and videos so that's it for here from Temecula we'll see you later